If I offered you poison to drink but gave you the antidote right after, would you still take the poison? Most people would say no, but millions of people all around the world do this exact same thing every day. I was at a coffee shop the other day and this young lady sat right next to me. She was a bit overweight and a little on the unhealthy side to put it nicely. After she sat down, she proceeded to take out what looked like an insulin pen, jabbed it in her abdomen, and gave herself a dose of insulin. Moments later, she took out a big bagel slathered in cream cheese and proceeded to devour it in the next five minutes. It was a sad thing for me to witness because she was essentially consuming poison and taking an antidote at the same time. I wish I could say that this isn't by design, but it really is. The pharmaceutical industry and the food industry sleep in the same bed together. The food industry profits by feeding you highly processed, sugary, salty, fatty foods that taste good, but provide absolutely no value to the human body. The pharmaceutical industry profits by giving you medications that help manage the illnesses that these foods create, but never actually heal you and cure you of your conditions. The food industry is making you sick and the pharmaceutical the pharmaceutical industry is keeping you barely alive. Why would this happen? Because a society that is weak and chemically dependent is easily manipulated and controlled. At Limitless Living, part of what we believe in is optimal health and optimal performance for the human mind and body. When you understand the system that is built around you and how it's being rigged against your health, you refuse to play by its rules. This is why I encourage everyone to educate themselves on proper health, good nutrition, good physical activity daily. And if you struggle with motivation and keeping a healthy lifestyle, reach out. I'm happy to provide resources that will point you in the right direction. Action.